Hi, my name is Scott Wiest and I'm an Applications Engineer. Today I'm going to show you the demonstration we put together um, that is showcasing uh, a lot of our RF equipment. So what we're showing here is generation and analyzation of an 802.11 AC signal. Um, that's the Wi-Fi uh, standard that's going to be the new uh, standard here in the next few years. Um, what's significant about the 802.11 AC is that it requires 80 megahertz of bandwidth. Uh, most testing equipment um, doesn't quite get up to 80 megahertz of bandwidth, so to, in order to test the new Wi-Fi systems that we're going to be putting out, we need to be able to get that full spectrum. So what we've done is we've taken the, the 5663, uh, or the 5673 generator, um, that's actually generating 80 megahertz of instantaneous bandwidth, showing the OFDM signals, um, and what we can do is take that signal and direct it uh, right into our down converter, the new Golden Gate 6505 down converter. Um, the intermediate frequency then for that 80 megahertz of bandwidth goes into um, a flex Rio. And we have an adapter module that allows up to 250 mega samples per second, which gets us that full 80 megahertz of bandwidth. Um, and as you'll see on the screen here, um, we're showing that 80 megahertz of bandwidth across the OFDM uh, subcarriers as a very, very flat line, uh, which is ideal for 802.11 AC. Um, you can also see our EVM per subcarrier, which is averaging at about uh, 47 dB, minus 47 dB, which is a really great accurate signal. Um, and then we can then see that signal here showing on our constellation. Uh, and this constellation is showing QAM 256, which is something that the, uh, the 802.11 AC standard uh, requires. So what we can do with this equipment is has very accurate, precise, um, and very wideband signals uh, that we can now test the newest technologies that are hopefully coming out in the next few years um, using the power of LabVIEW and National Insurance products.